Hey, Scott Austin here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use the section that I created for the Flex theme in your Shopify store to allow a text uh, H1 title for your page. Some of the pages and some of the sections and templates in the Flex theme allow you to do different things with the H1 or the title for the page, like putting it over a banner and things like that. But for this store, Hi Sweetheart, we wanted to keep things simple and just have a color background and then fix the height and have it be a little bit thicker so it was a bit of a branding element instead of just a smaller title. So I created this section and what it allows you to do is you can add it to a product, a page, or a collection and it'll automatically pull the title, depending on whether it's a page, you know, product, or a collection, fully appropriate title, and put it in H1. You know, that's good for SEO best practices. Or you can override the text that shows up. So in this store, we took all of our evergreen pages, like the shipping policy, we did the same thing. The FAQ, we did the same thing. Now, if I go in, because this is a section, I'm going to go in and customize this page. And it opens up theme customization in the Shopify admin. You'll see I have this section here, title. And I turned off the banner element and the page content, and I'm just using the accordion functionality for the Q&A. So on this title element, the controls I have, let's say instead of calling it frequently asked questions, which is the product or the page title, I could just say, well, I want to call it FAQ, so I can override that if I want to. You can also set the color, you can hide the divider or show the divider. And you can fix its height on desktop and on mobile. So you can say, well, let's go, you know, a really big one or have a minimum height of zero pixels and it'll pick the appropriate height based on the rest of the CSS of the font size and the margins and that kind of thing. So you get some control there on how it all lays out. And of course, you can, you know, center the text or left aligned and those things. So uh, that's how it works. And the way you add it to your store is it's just a section. So you have to add the section code. You can copy it from the Jade Puma website. So if you're looking at this on YouTube, there'll be a link to the Jade Puma website. If you're already on the blog article on Jade Puma, down below the video, you'll see that code. You just have to create a section with the same name that it shows you there. Copy the code into that, and you will be good to go. You can add it to any page, uh, product, or collection that you want to. So hopefully that helps. Thanks for watching.